welcome to Retro Crisis. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can use RetroArch to play your Nintendo 64 games in 4K. Now, before we continue, you'll need to know how to use RetroArch. If you don't, I've left a link to a beginner's guide in the description. For everybody else, let's continue. So first step is to open RetroArch and then go down to Online Updater, Core Downloader, and then go down to Nintendo 64. And then the core we're interested in is Moopin64 Plus next. Press enter to download. Once you've done that, load up a Nintendo 64 game of your choice. Once you're in the game, press F1 to go to the quick menu. And then go down to core options. Go down to RDP plugin. Press enter and make sure you have Glide N64 selected. Then go down to Glide N64 and then press enter. And now we just have to change a few settings. Firstly, we're going to adjust the render viewpoint dimensions. Go to 4x3 resolution. And here, you're going to want to select the screen resolution of your computer's monitor. As I'm using a 4K display, I'm going to go down to 2880 by 2160 And then go down to wide resolution, press enter. And again, select the resolution that closely matches your display. And then go down to aspect ratio and make sure this is set to 4x3. And finally, go down to Native Resolution Factor and press Enter. On this screen, we can multiply the native internal resolution. So if we go to 1x, the resolution will stay at 240p. If we go to 2x, we'll have 480p and so forth. Now, for this video, I'm going to go all the way to 8x which is the closest we can get to 4K. However, if your computer is maybe slightly weaker or not as strong, feel free to start small and then test incrementally and see how you get on. So once you've selected your resolution vector, press enter. So all you need to do now is shut down RetroArch, open it up again, and then select a Nintendo 64 game of your choice. Here's a quick showcase of Nintendo 64 games in 4K. 